Hey, yo, what is good? My name is Alvin. I'm here with another video for you guys. I'm gonna be real quick. We're here to discuss certain topics, having this open discussion with you guys, and you know, to spread a little seed of positivity. So let's get right into this. The topic I'm really wanting to discuss with you guys today is having boundaries and respect of those boundaries as well. So let's get right into this. I'm gonna be real quick with you guys. Let's go on. Start with just having respect. And it's then leading to the boundaries. Respect itself, you know, just having that sense of ground rules that you have for yourself. It could be a certain things. It could be from a religious standpoint or just how you truly feel about yourself. Just having that sense of worth. What you're willing to allow in your general area or what you're willing to allow other people to do in your general facility. You know, what people are allowed to say, what people are allowed to do and how they're willing to treat you in that same manner. So that goes with how we meet other people, friendships, all that, all that sort, you know, but we have any set of boundaries that we don't want people to cross because it will then feel like we are being disrespected in that same sense. I even want to go with dating. If someone comes up to you, you may or may not like what they say, but if they come with you with a compliment and they just say something that's super irate, just something that's off the wall, but in the sense that, you know, the way they said it or the way their emotion was felt, you feel offended because it's like, yo, you thought it was okay for you to say these things and thought, you know, I would accept them in the format that you will want me to, you know, you know, someone complimenting, for instance, if a male or I'm just, I'm just go with just a male because I'm just you know, I'm a male. If I'm me as a person, I walk up to a woman. And I'm just saying like, yo, you're beautiful, girl. You got a fatty. You got a fatty. Some people might get offended in that same format, and that's completely understandable because like I'm just going on something physical on your body that you may or may not be comfortable with especially if someone i don't you don't even know me but for me the first thing i come out of my mouth is just something like that i go around if i slap someone on that butt or so forth and then i'm like i don't know this person they haven't given me the, the access they haven't given me the privilege to do these things but i felt that it was okay just because like you know you felt that you either was more comfortable with yourself or you're attractive enough or just all these things you just felt that it was okay to say these things and think that the person is going to accept your emotions your feelings or whatever actions in a positive manner so you can convince them but at the end of the day it's it's their body you have broken that sense of you know acceptance that sense of boundaries that they have set for themselves because one that's completely disrespectful like you don't call up to an individual that you do not know and display things that they will do in a more comfortable setting you know saying certain things and you're not thinking things through and not really understanding how it affects other people you're just disregarding like you don't have really too much respect for that person and it shows you don't really respect a lot and disregarding the person's boundaries as well because you know what gave you the okay that's what we want to come down to what gives you the okay to do and to say certain things because you say it's okay you say in your mind that it's okay that it's okay to do certain things and say certain